what's good? It's your boy LB. And, um, you know, my new fighter, stay tuned, the killer, Mr. X, man. He came in and he had a peekable stance, and we were talking about it, stances, different stances. So, I want to speak on that, is that um, when you look at Jose Torres, you look at all of the fighters, the Mike Tysons, the, uh, the Floyd Pattersons, they all had that particular uh, customado peekable stance. And these stances are good. But what I teach my fighters is that Shapes are just shapes, and there's no, and we don't, and there's no shape to have to own. So, what does that mean? As a fighter, I can use this. I go here, I go here, I go here. So, you present different pitches for your opponent, and each shape needs to be trained a different way to make it uh, efficient. So, we'll take a look at one of my favorites. Everybody's seen the Philly Shell, you know, the roll. The out of sight, out of mind. What does that mean? Out of sight, you don't see this hand. So when I when I go to put it in your face, it kind of springs on you. It's like a surprise because it's not up here where you can see it. Kind of forget about it. So one way to train your Philly shell roll is with this. We all know I do this type of thing. So you want to fight in position, shoulder, look. This leg is supporting it. I can move. I don't want to give too much away. There it is. One of the ways you can train your Philly shell. 